Feck and feuch, two verbs that learners get confused with all the time. So what is the difference and how do we separate them in our heads from each other? Well, firstly, feck for C is pronounced as so, feck, and it is an irregular verb. So we can't really base too much off the root. It's going to be hunnic me in the past, niaka me, past negative, fecken me, and then fecky me for I see and I will see. The verbal noun is fecal. That's mainly going to be used with the infinitive in that case. So rodegen e ekol to see something. It's not related whatsoever to feoch, meaning watch or look. You can almost think of this as feoch air because we'll pretty much always use an air afterwards, similarly to how we'd use at with look in English. I don't say I look the phone, I say I look at the phone. So very similar concept in Irish for watch or look with feoch and then air afterwards. It is a regular verb, so that means we can base everything off the root. Deoch may in the past tense, feoch may in the present, and feoch may in the future. And the verbal noun is feochinch. It's going to be a bit different in the infinitive. If I'm saying to watch the television, it's going to be feochinch air on telefish. We're not going to flip it because like all of those verbs that have a preposition with them, we don't invert in the infinitive. Another example would be bula le mochorza, to meet with my friends. We're not going to put mochorza first like we normally would in the infinitive. If it's a bit too tricky and they sound too similar to each other, one thing you can do is use bratni instead of feoch for watch or look. It's used in the exact same way as feoch. It's just going to have a little air afterwards in the same way. So I can say bratni me for I watched, bratnium for I watch, and bratnoi me for I will watch, not forgetting the air if I'm naming what I'm watching afterwards.